Hey everybody, it's Mike Sprogue with New Burger and Company with this week's Training Tip Tuesday. This week, we are digging into dealing with the script of your life. Way back in 1997, Seinfeld set an absolute classic in motion with George Costanza and yada, yada, yada. For those of you that might not remember, George was engaged to be married and, and he and his fiance got some wedding invitations. His fiance tragically dies from licking the envelopes of the wedding invitations. In describing what happened to uh, a friend a couple of episodes later, George says, I was engaged, yada, 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 I'm still single. Now in 1997, when I was 20, that was kind of funny. In 2018, when I'm 40, that becomes kind of a useful concept. There are parts of my life, and I'm sure there might be parts of your life, that we would love to yada, yada, yada. We've got stories that we tell ourselves about where we came from, about what happened to us along the way, and how we ended up where we are. And some of those stories are great, and some of those stories are not so great. The challenge in today's environment is with social media, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, we are watching a never-ending highlight reel of everyone else's accomplishments that can get us in a really negative space. So the training tip for this week actually comes to us from William Shakespeare the Bard. In Hamlet, Polonius tells Hamlet, to thine own self be true. Look, we all have stories that we tell ourselves about how the past has been and what the future is gonna look like. And those stories can either reinforce some great behavior and great activity, or they can be self-limiting. You need to arrive at a place where we can accept what has happened in the past and understand that we are completely in control of what happens today to set a brighter future for tomorrow. So get honest with yourself, do some journaling, get into what is in that story, and make sure you can appreciate where you came from so you know where you're headed. If you have any questions or are looking for some help in changing the self-talk that you have or changing the story that you've written for yourself, feel free to reach out to me or any of the coaches here at Newberger & Company. We'd love to help. Thanks everybody and have a great week. We need to take a real look at where we are and how we got to be here. We've got to accept the things that have happened in the past and set our mind at ease for the task that we have to accomplish today. If we are living in the past, we can't get to where we're going to in the future.